So you've looked around and decided that Ottawa was the place for you. Well, this week we go over the five things you need to know before moving to Ottawa. And stay till the end because I got a little bonus for you. I'm Elik Matsu, the Ottawa Frenchman, and let me guess, after watching my other videos, you just fell in love with Ottawa and now you want to move here, right? That's all good, I understand, it's an exquisite city, but now we need to make sure to set you on the right track, so let's go over number one. Number one would be the agent. So obviously, it's important to reach out to a local real estate agent, and that would be me. Having someone local with you in this transaction gives you, an ac gives you access to information that you would otherwise don't have access to until you're actually here, which is too late. By working with me, you also get access to all my local professional resources to even further simplify the whole thing for you. We're talking lenders, lawyers, appraisers, the whole shebang. To start this up, you can email, text, or call me, and then we can open a lot of communication. That will be a great way for us to get to know each other, and then you can decide if you want to work with me or not. It's obviously important to like the agent you work with during this whole process. What we'll do during this first call, well, we'll talk about what you are looking for in your ideal home. What neighborhood you were interested in, what amenities you need clothes, how many bedrooms, bathrooms, you have kids, pets, do you need a huge backyard, are you looking for pre-owned versus new build, etc. It will be a great way to really zero in on your criteria, which leads us to number two, the custom search engine. So as realtor, we use the MLS search engine where we type in all the information and present you with, with homes that fits your needs. That's where the listings are, plus all the information on past sales, the agent names, etc. The big advantage of MLS is that it's always up to date, which is not always the case with sites like Purple Brick or Zillow, for example. People often call me with listings they found on those websites that they want to visit, and I have to be the one to tell them that the house they're looking for is already long gone. So what I can do for you is to set you up on the system so you get by email every home within your criteria that hits the market. It gives you a leg up on every other buyers out there, and it takes and it makes the search a thousand times easier for you. In fact, you don't have to search at all. You just wait for the property to come to you. You can also favorite the ones you like to help me adjust the search and get you even better results. Okay, so quickly guys, if you like this video, please just hit the like button here and I'm putting content out weekly. So if you don't want to miss all this amazing content, also hit the subscribe and the bell. Thank you. Okay, number three, talk to a lender. Number three is setting up the financing. So unless you plan on paying your house cash because somehow you have a few hundred grand lying there in your mattress, you're gonna have to set up a loan to buy your house. What you want to do is get with a lender, preferably a mortgage broker over a bank, but this is totally up to you. What you'll do is get your finances in order to get what is called a pre-approval. Now a pre-qualification letter and a pre-approval are not the same. Pre-qualification is done with very minimal research on you, your credit, employment situation, your debts, etc. When getting pre-approved, the process is way more thorough and gives you a far more reliable number to shop with. I'll link into this deeper into another video, but bear in mind that even pre-approval does not guarantee you can buy at that price. The property itself would be taken into consideration in order for the loan to be approved. Things like the property's condition and value can impact the amount you could get. So what you're looking for is really a pre-approval. It's our best tool to know upfront what house you can't and can't afford. Okay, touring home, number four, the exciting part, setting up some visits. Now we can do this in person or virtually if it's more convenient for you. Although if you decide to come down to Ottawa, give me a call, we'll set you up in a nice hotel or Airbnb and prepare you a compact showing schedule for the time you stay here. We'll be able to check out the neighborhoods, the locations, explore the town a little bit so you get a real feel for Ottawa and make sure that this town is the town for you which it will be for sure. You can also do this virtually if you're not too comfortable with traveling with this whole COVID situation. Basically, we schedule all the same showings and I take you with me around the house with my phone and you get to direct me around the house and really see every corner of the property like you were here yourself. Hopefully during those showings, you'll find your dream home. And if you do and you pre-approve, we can move on to the next step and put in an offer. That's why I stepped my game up and put together the best offer possible on your behalf end all the negotiations and get it accepted. If all goes according to plan, we can pop the champagne because you just got your dream house. So number five would be the buying process, specifically me taking you through the buying process. From the time that you get an offer accepted to the moment that you actually get your new keys, there's usually a 30 to 60 days period. During that time, conditions will be fulfilled, the real estate lawyer will search for the title, the funds will be transferred, etc. 
So between the accepted offer and closing day, I'm here to guide you through the process and make sure that everything that needs to get done gets done. Appraisals, home inspections, negotiation for repairs. There's a lot of different pieces that need to fall in place for the closing to go smoothly. And that's why you need an agent. Chances are that if you're relocating in Ottawa, you're probably living far off. So I take care of this here and keep you informed every step of the way. We also use electronic form now, so it's super convenient to do this all remotely. Okay, now that we're done with this, little bonus for you guys. For those of you who are interested in moving in Ottawa, but are unsure about the process or are first time home buyers, I have something for you. I made a 24 pages, totally free ebook on home buying in Ottawa. And that's exactly the tool you need to get on track to buy your first home. I'll put the link in the description, download it and tell me what you think. Okay guys, so to recap, number one, you call me. Number two, I set you up on a custom search engine. Number three, you call your lender, I get pre-approved. Number four, we set up showings. And number five, I make sure the buying process goes smoothly. And number six, you start a new chapter in your life. So I think that sounds pretty good. Again, everyone, you can call, text or email me. All my information is in my bio. I also answer every questions in the comments on my video. So don't hesitate to leave one. And uh, that sums it up for me today. If you like that video, you will definitely like the one I made about the five reasons me and my girlfriend moved to Ottawa. I'll put, this, the, I'll put the link on the screen in a few seconds. Thank you for watching guys. Take care and see you next week.